Hey guys, it's Jackie. I wanted to come on here and do a candle haul. I picked up a couple candles because this weekend with a 20% off coupon, they were $10, which is a really good deal. Don't mind me. I am a mess. Um, getting a text. I have been out in the yard working all day. It was a really, really nice day. It's Sunday night, so now I have time to sit down and film um, this video for you guys. I hope you had a great weekend. I hope you enjoyed your weekend. Here in Michigan, it rained most of Saturday. Um, we did have some sunshine, but then towards the afternoon, it really thunderstormed. I mean, it was kind of peaceful. Um, and then today, the sun was out. It got a little cloudy in the afternoon, but it was very, very pretty. I got my bike out. I rode my bike today, so we are on the track to be healthy. So I picked up some candles I wanted to show you guys. So thank you for coming back. If you like my channel, please subscribe and thumbs up the video that lets YouTube know that you like me. I picked up another Coastal Watermelon. Um, you guys know I hauled this a couple of weeks ago, but I have not burned it yet. Um, because I like to have two before I burn it. And this smells really good. I think this would be a really, really good candle for our sunroom. So the notes in here are Juicy Watermelon, a pinch of pink sea salt and ocean waves with essential oils. So I picked that one up. The next one I got, I don't believe I've hauled this one. I feel like it came out at Christmas time or candle day. So I might have gotten it in different packaging. You'll have to correct me or I'll look back and see. But this one is Pink Apple Punch. Try to get, it's really, really cute with the watermelon or the pineapple with sunglasses. Sorry, really tired from working out in the sun all day. Um, this one is Green Apple Juicy Honey Crisp and Pink Melon Punch. And the reason why I got it is because it's not too much on the apple. I don't know what it is about apple candles. When I go to burn them, they don't burn as well as like melting wax. Because with Scentsy, I love my Johnny Apple Seed, but when I burn a Bath & Body Works candle with apple, it doesn't smell right. And it could just be the last one I got was at, um... What was it? The crisp green apple that smelled, ugh, I wouldn't recommend it. Um, but I like this one and I love the packaging. This is the same packaging as the uh, coconut water. Isn't it coconut water? Yeah, coconut water. And I thought it was really, really cute. Um, on cold snip, this reminds me of a perfume. And I don't know, um, it kind of reminds me of one of the DKNY apple perfumes. That's what it smells like to me on cold sniff. Um, I did only pick up one, but I will burn this because it's not something that, you know, I'm going to keep looking for unless I really, really like it and it burns very well. So I'll burn that and then review it for you guys. And then the second one, somebody had mentioned this one. I'll not talk while I unwrap it. This is the Island Papaya. Um, I love this one. Oh, we need to do a thumbnail. Um, it's got flamingos on there, kind of hard to see, and then it's a very, very pretty beach scene. Um, when Joe and I went on our cruise last year for my 40th birthday, um, we saw pink flamingos in Costa Maya, Mexico. They were so pretty, and somebody told me the reason why flamingos turn pink is because they, um, it's either something in the nutrients that they eat or the fish or something. I can't remember what it was. If you know please let us know, um, or I can just Google it too. Um, this one is Tropical Coconut, Fresh Papaya, and Sugar Cane. So somebody said that they liked the wallflowers in this, and it. And then one of my friends at Bath & Body Works, she was saying that a lot of people were getting the wallflowers. So I wanted to get a different candle to review because I do like tropical scents out in my sunroom, like to you know, give yourself that um, vacation feel or, you know, just something, you know, fresh. So on cold sniff, I don't know, it might be the papaya that's given it the fruity scent. Oh, and I forgot, to, it's just uh, cream colored wax. It's three wicks. This one was poured on the 130th day of 19 this year. Um, the pink apple punch was poured on the 119th day. And the Coastal Watermelon, which is an A6, so probably a batch, was poured on the 91st day of 2019. Um, 
but I really like the packaging on this. Um, we went to a couple of garage sales yesterday, my sister-in-law, Ange, and I did, and I got a really, really nice brown leather chair for our sunroom, but for whatever reason, <laughs> it has a, a um, I don't want to say it stinks, but it has like a distinct odor in it. So you know that it's real leather because it's kind of holding that odor. So I have I lit one of my butterscotch toffee candles right next to it because whatever is in that candle kind of permeates whatever's next to it. Because sometimes I'll light a butterscotch toffee candle and I'll leave my house and I can still smell it. And so I want something fresh for out in the sunroom because I love that room, especially in the evenings. We have like lights hanging around, you know, the sliders. So we put that comfy chair in there and we just have been trying to, you know, spray different things on there. We bought Lysol. We cleaned it really well. Um, I think it's just, you know, someone else, they told us they hardly used it, but it, I think it like sat in their basement or something. So I was hoping like this Island Papaya, I could light it next to it and it kind of, you know, cover that smell. But those are the three candles that I picked up. Not bad for $30 because they were $10.36 a piece. And then I did get, um, oh, I guess I could tell you exactly how much they were because I have my receipt. Yeah, $10.36 a piece. Um, so, and it was funny, uh, we lost power in certain areas of our house and Bath and Body Works is one of them. So the girls got to go home early last night. And then I got a couple of the 10 off of 40 for semi-annual, which starts on the 10th. Really, really excited to see what candles come out um, for that. I need some new fresh candles. So if you guys have heard of any, I know there's a new one coming out for 4th of July. Um, and there's that blueberry pie. What was the other one? Um, saltwater taffy I heard about. So I'm really excited to try to get my hands on those. I hope you guys are doing well. I hope you have a great week. I can't believe it's already June. Um, I hope you have a good evening. Don't forget to do something nice for yourself and I'll talk to you soon. Bye!